Hey YouTube, this is Firewizard23, and I'd like to welcome you to another Let's Play I'm going to do here. Uh, welcome to the Let's Play of, well, let's have the game introduce itself. Oh, don't look here, don't look. Let's play Metal Combat! So, yeah, so, there's actually... This uses the Super Scope, that's this little sniper thing you see right here. And I've actually completely gotten rid of all my save data. We're going to start right from the very beginning if you've ever picked up this game for the very first time. Oh, wait. I don't want to go there yet. <laughs> Get back to the subscreen here. Notice we're ranked 32 and we're, uh, this is like our, out of 1 out of 32, we're number 32, and we're called an amoeba. That's what we are, we're the ST Falcon. Let's adjust our aim here. So let me see if I can fill in kind of the story elements of what's going on here. This takes place a couple years after the very first game called Battle Clash, which to be fair, I never really, I never played that game originally. I've played it now on emulation, but I find this to be the better game of the two, only because of the additional weapons and the better attacks you can do. And what we're doing here is we, uh, the ST Thanatos, the standing tank Thanatos, was destroyed, and now we have been set to try to, um, uh, it actually came back, and now we're trying to see if we can be this guy's gunner. I forget what his name is right now, I'm drawing a complete blank. But anyway, uh, let's read this. Hello, I am Rola, and I will be your training instructor. Before you compete in the battle game, you must train. Uh, the battle game is basically when two giant standing tanks fight each other. First one to die loses. Simple as that. If you follow my instructions, you will clear each level. So let's talk about targeting. Your first lesson covers the use of turbo shots. To use turbo shots, press and hold the fire button. You gotta shoot down three enemies. Okay. I, I found this to be a really fun game. Nice... You just want to go head-to-head -head with somebody. So yeah, we just hold the fire button here. Oh. Now he's dead. There we go. <laughs> Comes another one. These little mushroom dudes. Yep. There we go. There we go. We leveled up. Now we talk about defense. Uh, basically, we can use the turbo shots to destroy enemy projectiles before they hit our before they hit us. Enemy projectiles hit us, we take damage. So now we got to shoot down six of these bolts using our turbo shots. And you can shoot this guy all you want, but he's got a lot of defense. So, yep. See, that's all you got to do. Two more to go. Nice. And we win. Yeah! Note, most enemies don't take damage when you destroy their shots. <laughs> now the energy bolt. If you don't press fire, that gauge on the bottom is going to charge. And when it's full up at least one bar, if you press fire, you fire an energy bolt. So check this out. We gotta get, th we gotta destroy three of these monsters, or enemies. Watch. Oh, first make sure you hit them. There we go. Nice. There we go. Talk about intercepting. You can use energy bolts to def energy bolts to block enemy fire as well. And if it's a blinking bullet, you specifically have to use energy bolts to knock it down. You can't use a turbo shot. So now they want us to block four of these shots using an e using an energy bolt. So hold for a sec. Here it comes. Nice. 
And if your bolt is powerful enough, it will blow through the enemy's bolt and can potentially cause some damage if it hits them. Mike Anderson, that's his name. Okay, that's the name of the, the pilot of the ST Falcon that we're in. We're trying to see if we can be his gunner. There we go. <laughs> I knew I'd remember his name. Is it ultimately critically important to playing this game? No. <laughs> this, is an RP this isn't an RPG, for goodness sake. Okay, now the treble energy bolt. Specifically with the ST Falcon, if you keep letting this thing charge, it keeps lighting up these lamps, and then they all flash just like this. If you press the fire button, you'll shoot a treble energy bolt. And it can make weak, spot weak spots flash on the opponent, and then shoot those weak spots with energy bolts. Basically, take advantage of weak spots when you know the opponent has them. Check this out. Uh, ah, Kaioken! So it's that flashing part right there. Kaioken! I love that graphic. Kamehameha! Oh, come on. Gotcha. Next, we're going to talk about the bomb. You get a lot of side items in this game, and in this case, you get a bomb. Bombs can destroy, can cause enemy damage, and they also destroy all the projectiles on the on the screen. So they can be really useful for, in a scrape. Watch this. Just fire the bomb. Yeah, admittedly that wasn't much of a lesson, but we're doing what we can with what we got. One moment. Okay, sorry about the interruption, folks. Okay, so we're going to do our very first combat. I know that bomb wasn't really that impressive, but it gets more useful as we go on. So we're going to do a simulated battle game against Rolla. She's going to command this ST, and first one to be destroyed loses. Let's do it. My bar's on the top, enemies on the bottom. Let's do it. Fight! First, let's start with, an er with a treble energy bolt. Nothing. Let's try it again. Let's use a bomb! Oh, this is over. This is so over. Done. Woohoo! Congratulations, you are now trained as an ST gunner. Many opponents, each using a different offense, will be found along your way. Do not be afraid. You know the techniques necessary to win. You can defeat any of them by aiming correctly, shooting at their weak point, and most of all, defending yourself. Do not forget what you've, what you've learned in this training program. Now go to the battle game and win. So we're now Mike Anderson's gunner. And we're going to head towards Thanatos. But we got to get through his chiefs on the world map to get, get to him. And folks, we're going to we're gonna continue that exploration in the next video. So I'm Firewizard23. This is going to be the Let's Play of Metal Combat Falcon's Revenge. And as I say on Quillen, have the best day ever.